Coming in with our next Hampshire boar. This is Lumberjack. While he's bringing Lumberjack in, I was remiss. I need to introduce Scott and Bob Liston for you guys that don't know. Scott and Sheriff Evans are dear friends and, and help us throughout the year, year round. And I appreciate their friendship and appreciate their help and all that they do. And uh, Scott is, uh, is a good resource for us to work with. And he's a good sounding board for me. He keeps me honest and keeps me grounded. Bob Liston, uh, you should not need an introduction. Uh, Bob Liston is uh, a, a legend, and a legend in the Southwest. And frankly, through Tom's long friendship with Tom or with Bob, we've been able to become friends with Bob, and it's been a tremendous friendship. And I appreciate both these men. I don't think there's anybody that reads hogs any better than these two, and so that's why I, I like to uh, have them here. I'm thrilled to have them here and listen to comments on the boars. Now, this boar is Lumberjack. Lumberjack is a Bush League uh, time special. He's bred by Drake Purebred Farms. He was a grand champion Hampshire boar at the Ohio State Fair in 2016. And it's kind of interesting, a family up around Worcester bought this boar and, and bred him to just exclusively crossbred sows. And they sent us pictures of the pigs out of this boar and they absolutely blew us away. And they dominated that area up there with those pigs. And so we had the opportunity to buy this boar again. And uh, I've got pictures that uh, you can get with me later if you have an interest in this boar of his mommy. Um, but talking to uh, uh, Daryl Drake and to Wade uh, Hendricks there at, uh, at Drake's, uh, this may be one of the very best elite boars Drake has ever made. Uh, we have him here to breed, to make females. We've got sows bred to him. We've got pigs on the ground. We're very pleased with him. This is Lumberjack. Kevin showed me a picture of this one's mama yesterday. I hadn't seen it yet, and I don't really know why he was withholding that information from me. But uh, that sow's really good. And, and to come from Drake's, and for him to say that that one's out of his best sow, Daryl Drake doesn't give you much information. He's pretty, uh, pretty matter of a fact, and just uh, it is, it is. It's black, it's black, it's white, it's white. So for him to make that comment, that's pretty impressive. And, and when we travel around and, and look at hamsters and try to figure out how to fix them and how to build them, the number one problem, and, and I'll say this all night long, about even about the crossbred boars, the number one problem we still see is center rib, shaper rib, and pastern set. And this guy will fix you in those two places. Uh, I got a chance to look at his daddy when he was at Thompson's, and, and that one was one that they just kind of kind of laid in there and, and bred to some good sows. And, and, and for that one to go to Brock's, as, as critical as they are on pasture and set and center body and, and actual uh, uh, turn to the rib, that said something to me. And then when, we, when, I, when I found out about this one, it, that one reminds me of his daddy. Great built, good rear leg, big ribbed. Um, he'll moderate you some if your sows are kind of kind of big and stringy, and he will bring you back to center in terms of rear leg and build behind in the way they set out of their out of their ankles and into their pastures. So again, if you're trying to make your Hampshire sows better, I don't know that he's a barrel bore. I don't know that he's going to make enough uh, enough kind of big big end in them. But uh, but as far as making sows better and making your Hampshires better on the backside, I think that's one you dig into. We have this boar priced at $50 a dose. If you buy 10 doses, uh, pay uh, uh, in a contract, it's $40 a dose. I will make just uh, another mention. He's 96% on his breed composition. So he's a high ranking boar there. And um, one thing I will mention is the pigs out of him and the pigs we have on the ground are now are extremely heavy muscled. So you may not look at him and think he would sire muscle. This boar sires muscle. So this is Lumberjack.